This is ridiculous, I apologize. The feed is slow too. Oh my gosh. Well, this is frustrating. I I just noticed that my like I pull up I try to pull up a website and it just takes forever. So I should be getting a lot faster internet. Um, figure this out but uh, this is making me very upset George is getting upset It's dead right now. I can't even get going. Anyways, let's make it happen. How hard would it be to <sighs> I apologize this is really frustrating anyways uh, how hard would it be to make his eyes the same size same size um, not really that hard I mean everything is right now is just a dynamesh um, so it just mainly just be like, okay, let's tweak this and then, you know, fudge that back. So it's, it really wouldn't be too hard. Um, but just to get like the style that the concept artist uh, is kind of made. Uh, I want to try to hit that, the style. I mean, that's what appealed to this character is these thick, you know, thick things going on. Um, anyways, let's make a hat. So I've I've gotten into this um, battle of the up and down. Oy, so sorry. Um, I just been using uh, Q Mesh to insert, you know. As you can just, you know, with hats especially, because they're so, you know, they're so really easy to block in with. With the key mesh brush, you know, you got your square and then the brim is going to just be an extension of that, so.
So just as long as I'm like trying to get, you know, try to hit that overall form. Which I think I could get um, mostly with just a few shapes here. Um, very similar to the same to the same way that I did the Cyrus hat actually. Um, I think I did that one with all zero mesh too, or not zero mesh, but the cube, the Z modeler brush. Yeah, it, hats are so easy to do. Um, you know, you add in a few geometry points, and um, you know, the first thing I try to do is just block out like the the symmetry of it get get the main core shapes there and then um, yeah this hat's just a little bit different but theoretically it's the really kind of the same thing the same process And you know, just add in little bits of geometry to start working out. You know, then you get to a point where um, more or less you just have to start. doing some asymmetry and I'll, I'll get that going too but just trying to be smart with my low poly block in and then I'll start turning off symmetry and then get I mean this is cool I like how it swoops up and then this side isn't this side's a you know, flat. Then you can start being a little creative how you're using your geometry again to mac you know, get that shape. That's all the Z modeler brush, you know, it's just you're working with cubes and just slowly build up, you know, off that really simple way of working, but you get really, you know, you can get really clean. Um, you know, base mesh real quick.
Yeah, J this is Javis car or um, Javier Burgos concept. He is an he's a great uh, concept artist. Been following his work for a long time. Thank you for sharing his art station. Yeah, I was just looking at like what would be fun to do tonight. Um, there's no real rhyme or reason why I chose it. it just uh, I, I picked a couple of images that I thought um, looked kind of fun to do. And, you know, just had some interesting shapes to it. Yeah, I left Com Comcast for some reason. Why did I leave Comcast? <sighs> um, it looks like I will be going back to Comcast, so that, at least they'll be happy about that, huh? Maybe it's this is their doing. They're like, oh, you think you can switch, eh? Try to get out of us, huh? Yeah, it's probably Comcast trying to get back at me. I mean, this is this has gotten like comical, like how bad it is, right? Hi guys. John, John, John Mitsu, Mitsu, John Mitsu. Thanks for joining us. Hi 
Um, technically, I'm supposed to be off in a couple of minutes, but... <laughs> yes, I'll, I'll tell... That is actually probably the best way that I could do it. Like, hey, you, do you know how many people are watching this? 300 billion thousand. That's how many. Now, uh, luckily, like, by before getting on to him, I said, okay, I need, like, some sort of deal. So at least I have 30 days to, to get out of it or not. Let's do some glasses. Did I ever finish the skater girl? No, I haven't finished her. Um, I was gonna do her, like start working on her again tonight. I've kind of gotten like off her groove, so it was gonna be it was gonna take a little bit to get back into it. Um, so when I'm officially back, because this is kind of like a a one time deal uh, for this month um, I want to get back into to finishing her on the stream um, let's do those glasses real quick oh yeah um yeah of course you, you you know that's that's probably another a really good way still to do the hat is just take two shapes and and dynamesh them or boolean them together. Um, I mean that's the way that I used to do it before uh, ZBrush came out with Z Remesh and Z Modeler and um, you know I even still do things that way. So I yeah that's a, that's still a great way to do things. Okay, let's do save. Um, I'll stay on another, you know, 15, 20 minutes. Um, yeah, so I'll stay on for another 15 or 20 minutes um, just to try to make up some of the time that we've lost during the downage. And... Uh, You know, see if we can get those glasses on here. Okay, up in. So, if this is how I do my glasses. Then just start blocking out the shape of these glasses. Hello. No pressure. Oh, good. <laughs> uh, Century Link. Century Link is who I'm with right now, and I'm not. I'm not happy.
<laughs> yeah. Century Occasional Link would probably be the best name that they could get. Yeah, it just sucks to have to deal with you guys have to deal with it. But thanks for sticking around. Super glad that you guys are doing that. When I'm back for sure, I'm you know, I'll make sure I get all the kinks out because this is this is the worst. Oh, no worries. She's a she's a massacrist at heart. Glasses.
Hey, we'll see you at T Marshall. Thanks for coming in. Yeah, we'll get it we'll get it up. Even if I just have to record it on my own and send it over to him. <laughs> Yeah, the skater croc and the skater. I think it's like skate croc, by the way. Kids. I really like work, working on uh, stuff like this where you get a lot of weird asymmetry. You know, it's, it's kind of hard to figure out in 3D. Um, another reason why like ZBrush is great is you can you have a lot of versatility and to like try to uh, come up with these really weird um, shapes. You know, try to to interpret this in, in 3D. It's, it's a lot of fun. You know, it's it's a challenge. It's a lot more challenge. You know, it's a lot more challenging than than you know trying to hit um, you know maybe a, a more um, fully developed concept. But this is this is a lot of fun. You know, trying to figure out like what does this shape actually look like in three D if it were in 3D.
Well, okay, everyone. I think we are going to call it a night. Um, I apologize for the technical difficulties. Uh, you know, hopefully we had some fun in between the crashings. <laughs> So thanks for everyone for stopping by. Thanks for your questions, your comments. Um, and you guys are beautiful. <laughs> so grateful uh, that I was able to be here again tonight. Thanks ZBrush and Pixelogic for having me on again. Hopefully I'll join you um, in the near future for more consistency. Um, thanks Squid Tank, uh, Darken. You guys are great. Um, so when, once this is done, I'll post it up to, uh, uh, to my social medias and whatnot. So Blands, hey, thanks for, thanks for coming by. So you guys have a good night or morning, Darkin. <laughs> um, yeah, thanks. Thanks so much for joining in. You guys have a good night. Bye.